I'm 20 years old. I don't know what love is. I know that it's a feeling and what it's like to really like something. I know that I really like pho and I really like making dumb internet videos. But I don't know what it's like to fall madly in love. I grew up around a lot of hard-headed, stubborn men who only know how to show tough love. So the only kind of love I know is feeding you food and calling you a pussy when you can't do 20 push-ups. The only form of love for a woman a lot of us guys are taught isn't actually love, but instead it's just lust. We want to be like those rappers we see on the internet with the baddest girls whose only purpose is seemingly to be there to boost your ego and clout. I remember when I was younger I would get this warm fuzzy feeling talking to the girl I like, but anytime I would feel that, I would immediately shut my feelings off because ew, love is gay and you're weak if you show it. In high school, when you're with your boys, you can't let your guard down for a second or else they'll tear you to shreds, and it's supposedly coming from a place of love. Stop being a pussy, bro. Are you a homo or something? It feels as if you have to maintain this image of being hard and emotionless all the time, to the point where you feel you can only display up to three emotions. That is, happy, neutral, and anger. But behind closed doors, I'm cuddled up in my bed watching your lie in April thinking, Shige Karisama, don't die! I'm in my room by myself watching cheesy 2000s rom-coms, imagining myself in the same scenario as the main characters and wishing one day I could have my notebook moment. Because the truth is, for most guys, underneath all that tough guy act is just a scared, insecure little boy who needs his mama. And we've all been knowing this. So to the guy who's been feeling a little less masculine today because Becky went out with Chad instead of you, it's okay to say that you feel a little sad and that you need a hug. It's okay to want to cry because you feel inadequate in life. But it's also okay to act like none of that bothers you. Because sometimes you need your boys calling you gay and a pussy just as much as you need a girl telling you she loves you. I think true strength comes from what you do in the face of adversity. When you come face to face with what makes you weak, but still, you hold your head up high. Even though a majority of guys are suffering from the lack of love, what's important is that you don't let those feelings manifest into something ugly from the inside out. To not let what you lack make you weak, and instead, make you stronger. Learn to show love without needing to receive it first. Because when you realize everyone around you is just as desperate as you are for affection, you can be the person that makes things just a little better for everyone else. I don't know what love is, or how to find it, but what I do know is that we all feel it, and we all just want to be accepted for it.